हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू माय चैनल स्टडी सुप्रीम इफ यू आर न्यू टू दिस चैनल प्लीज सब्सक्राइब फॉर स्किल एनहेंसमेंट इन योर करियर इन दिस वीडियो वी विल डिस्कस अबाउट हाउ टू डू डिबक कोड इन साइप्रेस एंड डिबकिंग इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट पार्ट वाइल डूइंग द टेस्टिंग इफ यू आर फाइंडिंग एनी इश्यूज इन योर कोड सो वाइल हेल्प ऑफ डिबकिंग वी कैन गेट टू नो अबाउट दैट uh where is the actual issue of that okay we can say debugging is the process to identify and fixing the error and issues in your automated test case and you can find out that identify that source code where it is happening so let's start regarding debugging so how to do debugging in cypress this is our vs code and uh, we want to do debug so we can take the same example of that in last video we discuss about alias concept so we'll take that only we'll create another file i will copy this one we'll create another file which is related to debug okay right click on that create new files okay debug test case debug test Okay, this is a debug test case dot cy dot ts. Okay, and we can paste it. Why I'm pasting? Like we will not waste the time. We directly we can do debug the test case, and we will got to know how debugging is working. Okay, this is our test case. Now we will run the test case. <coughs> As of now, we're debugging in your we did not cap any debugger in your code. And directly running a test case i want to show like how before the debugging is working and after debugging how it will work okay we have to debug debug okay and uh, i want to say one thing in this code uh, like we are accessing the value this is like alias start playing and we want to access like this dot start playing equal to equal to start playing okay so it should be print okay so before that i want to like add one point here this functions we will not read the value okay so it will not read the value so i want to show you the test case is getting passed but in the test second it block second is there it block second we want to print that we start playing let's see is printing or not you can see there is no code of that plot printing how i want to so i want to add this same thing here we will get to know about that more okay outside then function value okay now i will run the test case again now you can see the exact things okay now you can see here is coming then method value is undefined we are not able to access that value so for that we will check now we want to keep the debugger and we want to ask, see like that what value we are getting okay so debugger we can keep debugger directly we can keep the debugger here we can keep the debugger and save it this file okay so at the moment we will save the file that test case is running and you can see here debugger is not your test case is running that is not that so make sure how to enable the debugger in your code level so we have to like cypress is running in this browser in same browser we have to click right click go to the inspect make sure it should be the correct only okay after that uh, we are getting the element console source network after that we have to rerun the test case our oh, test case is rerunning okay now we are able to see after rerun the test case your test case is like pause in debugger and right side we are able to see this is our code you can see the alias is there debugger is there and why i am saying it's a real time test runner that allow to developer to pause the test case you can see the our code also 
if you see the code and you can use these things see see undefined it's coming it's coming undefined where well, if you are more sour more souring we do so it will come that undefined so this is like process to find out okay and in watch time also watch is there you can see start dot uh, uh, this dot start playing is undefined if you want to use another things you can use it anything like uh, suppose you want to check the text of that yeah this one okay it will be like uh, what is there uh, like this is a different one it block uh, this is different second one is different so it will be erase the value that is not a issue if will if you are keeping upper also what is that read 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 text dot text see it will become it will become blank only everything because uh, that both are different see not available because we are debugger is here and this value will not come here in that point okay so this is like you can see uh, start dot uh, this dot start playing is undefined now we'll come to the correct point now you can like if you want to forward next step we have to click on this button arrow button it is like going to the next step see it's going this next step and here also you can see undefined equal to equal to start playing is not there then it's not printing okay this is also next step only okay guys both are same okay see this is like a step into the next call and step into the next call f10 f11 okay we have to use okay this is a process to debug but now why is not getting we have to use the function here just a minute i will copy this functions you can copy this functions okay now we have to debug again our debug debugger is already on and you are running the test case again debugger mode is started and you can see debugger mode is started and we are getting start dot playing is there see you can see the start dot playing we are able to see the start dot playing means start dot playing is coming and here in watch also start dot playing is coming so it means we are debugging successfully like we are getting the value and now if you want to next next see you can see both are correct same this is this is same then it will it will run the test case you can start the purge okay now you can see we are getting the both the value then value is start playing and inside access out outside then method start playing is printing if condition is getting passed so this is a process to run or uh, debug your test cases and find the issues in your test thank you for watching my video don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel so you won't miss any new videos